Patricia, thank you. Meanwhile, KTLA's Chip Yost was also in New York for this weekend's 9-11 ceremonies. He spoke with an Orange County man whose daughter was aboard the second plane that crashed into the Twin Towers. He was asked about his personal tragedy and what he thought of the new memorial. Jobs and the economy are the primary focus of President Obama. Today, he urged Congress to pass the American... Well, nearly 25,000 people have joined in the effort to ban the sale of shark fin here in California. They're now urging Governor Jerry Brown to sign the landmark legislation. Arkansas-based company Cargill has recalled 185,000 pounds of ground turkey products. The item Well, scientists have developed a strain of green glowing cats with cells that resist... For the latest health news, click on KTLA dot com slash health and non jury trial and the judge was quick to make his decision guilty on five different counts so now the man who single-handedly forced the shutdown of nine schools because of a lie he construed is headed to prison it was january 19th when 30 now prosecutors say stenrus's hopes may have cost more than three hundred fifty thousand dollars the judge ordered that stenrus undergo a psychological exam at a state prison before his sentencing hearing on december 14th for ktla 5 news i'm leela feinstein micah back to you. Leela, thank you. A bellflower team.